Hey Water Signs and welcome to my channel. And Joe here is doing your Tuesday, November 13th, 2018. Love reading. Um, I tried to post your guys' reading for Monday earlier for today. And I thought it posted and I left and I came back and it didn't. I may still try to repost it, but I figured I'd get your guys' out for tomorrow since the day is pretty well over. So I think I will go ahead and post, try to repost them just so you can see them, but right now we're going to focus on Tuesday, November 13th. This is for Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. So I will point you on down here. Beautiful ones of love and light. What do the collective water signs need to hear for Tuesday, November 13th? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio in that order. Uh, bottom of the deck will be your shared energy. All right. Okay, Cancer, you guys have the Nine of Pentacles. Pisces, you guys have the World. And Scorpio, you guys have the Queen of Pentacles. Your guys' the shared energy is the Four of Swords. Clarified by the Three of Wands in reverse and the King of Pentacles in reverse. Bottom of your deck is the Seven of Swords. So um, all of you guys, um, you're taking a step back. You could be taking a break from an earth sign, taking time to heal. Um, you're at a distance from this person currently, but that's going to be um, ending. The distance between the two of you is going to be ending very soon. Um yeah, some of you could be moving closer to this person. This person could be mo moving closer to you. But it was all in divine timing. Uh, because this is your blessings are being blocked. Let me scoot you back a little bit. There we go. All right. So, Cancer, you guys are single and looking great. Oops. <clears throat> some of you are going currently going to school or en enrolled in classes and you're taking a break. From somebody um, because you're concentrating on your finances. Let's see here. Cancer males. Ooh. Cancer females. This one wanted to pop. All right. So um, cancer males, you guys uh, are breaking free. This person is toxic to you. You're having toxic thoughts. Um, you are constantly thinking about a person that you are um, currently separated from, um, you're at a distance from this person, it's time to break free of those uh, obsessive thoughts. Uh, focus on yourself, begin this healing process so the two of you can come back in together um, because it's time to take time for you, concentrate on you, and break free from this toxicity. You could have addictions as well. Um, so it's the universe is just pushing you in a direction to to clear out everything toxic and negative from your life and start focusing on how you can um, become a better person. And in that time of healing, a lot of things are going to come forth for you and then your blessings will start coming in. Cancer females, you guys, uh, you're taking a leap of faith um, with yourself. You are not wanting love right now. You are still healing as well, but you are taking a risk, taking a chance with money, um, you guys are looking great, uh, cancer females. This is going to pan out very well for you, whatever you're taking a chance with. Um, you could be going for a job that you didn't think you could have, uh, something along those lines. You guys is, oh, keep dropping that card. You guys is outcome for Tuesday. What is cancer's outcome for Tuesday? November 13th, this one popped. The King of Swords. So you're making decisions. You're taking action. You're no longer um, living out of your heart. You're you're taking a more logical approach to things. You're um, you're making choices that are best for you, and that's how it should be. Cancer. Um, you guys are overall going to have a pretty good day. All right, Pisces. You guys are closing out chapters, ending cycles, um, going into some much needed time of healing. Um, after the end of whatever cycle this was, um, Pisces, Pisces men, 
Thank goodness, I can't control my deck here. Way too many cards. Okay, Pisces men, what are you ending? What cycle is coming to a completion? Okay, Pisces females. All right, so um, Pisces men, you guys got the three of wands in reverse twice. So you had to end a cycle before your blessings would come in. Um, you're not letting something go that needs to be let go of. Could be something to do with money. But um, take this time to take a step back to look at things from a different um, angle to see what all your options are because you need to let the cycle end before your blessings, before what you want to come forward to you is going to come forward. Um, Pisces females, you guys are feeling like somebody um, somebody threw you out in the cold pretty much. Somebody could have stolen some money from you as well or you're missing money. Um, that's going to all be worked out in the justice system for some of you. Uh, it's going to be figured out in court. And it's going to bring you back out of this um, struggle, financial struggle that you're going through. Your blessings, your finances will improve. Pisces, when you guys let this go, move on from it and heal from it. Don't keep holding on to things from the past. That's what's keeping you in this financial struggle. Let it go. It's not meant for you. Better is coming in for you, I promise. What is Pisces outcome for Tuesday? Oh, way too many. One card, please. Thank you. Wow, look at that. <laughs> so when you guys let go, when you allow this cycle to complete, when you allow this to fall by the wayside, um, you're going to come into a financial opportunity and love and family that is going to benefit you greatly. That's what your blessings are. But until you let go of this situation and heal from it, you, you're not going to get that blessing of the Ten of Pentacles. All right, Scorpios, you have the Queen of Pentacles. You guys are sitting pretty good. You're dealing with a soulmate, Scorpios, because uh, the King and Queen are here. Uh, the Your partner is out of balance, or if you are the male Scorpio, uh, you're dealing with somebody who's keeping you in balance. So let's see here, Scorpio males, uh, very loving, nurturing energy around you. Females, Scorpio females. Okay, so Scorpio men, you guys are not realizing what you have. You have a gem here. Um, you are currently uh, out of balance here. You need to find some grounding. You need to realize what you've got is a blessing. The universe is trying to show you something in a loving, nurturing way. Um, could be through a mother figure or um, like a partner that's trying to reach out to you. Um, you're being get handed a gift, but you're not seeing it. So really your blessings are here, but you're blocking it out. It's time to heal and let go of hurt from the past um, so you can realize the blessings that are being bestowed to you. Scorpio females, you're giving up the fight. You are tired of the only one that's battling for this. You've been loving. You've been nurturing. You've been there for them. You have been caring. You have tried to help them through this. And no matter what you do, you feel like you can't do nothing right. Um, so just take a step back today and allow yourself some you time. What's the outcome for Scorpios today? Yeah, you need some healing from this earth sign male. Yeah, you're just feeling drained, emotionally drained with a soulmate. Um, this is somebody you could also have children with, but um, you need to take some time to get over this emotional draining situation. Um, this is going to work out for the best, but you're just, you're giving and giving and giving and you're not getting your energy um, replenished in the exchange of energy. You're just giving and not getting anything back. So let it go and take some you time. And this person is going to come um, back very quickly to make things right. Um, and to, to come back in a more healed nature where they can give you just as much as you're giving them as far as your energy and emotions. All right. Let's see what the angel romance angels has to say today. One card for cancer, please. All right. Pisces. Scorpios. Okay. So, um, cancer, uh, you have, um, met somebody that is currently caught your attention. Um, these are worth explore exploring. Let go of your expectations, um, of what this should be, because this is real love. These feelings are real. Um, and just, and just, um, let time, 
uh, be the leader. Don't try to push things. Don't try to make things go faster is what my angels are saying. Um, Pisces, it's time to um, get out there and extend your lighthearted energy to others. Be flirty. Have fun. Enjoy yourself. Life is not all that serious. Live in the moment. Stay grounded. Don't focus on the future. Don't focus on the past. Live for today and have fun with it. And you're going to find that you're going to enjoy life a lot more. Scorpios, it's time to let go of control issues. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. Um, like I was just saying, let time, uh, time will tell what this is going to, what's going to happen. Everything happens for a reason and it's going to happen in your benefit, Scorpios. So just try to let go of control issues. This earth sign that you're dealing with, um, I think there was earth, uh, air. Well, you have earth, air, and fire. So um, this person has to do things on their own time. You can't rush them or it's just going to make them push further away. So let go of that control issue and allow them to move towards you in the speed and manner that they um, that they need to. So, all right, water signs, I hope you have a fabulous Tuesday. I will see you next time. God bless.